um let's jump on straight to the Otile Brown interview. Nimesikia se wengi on the socials complaining saying that Otile Brown akona maringo. I don't think akona maringo. I just think is it's just the way nigga <laughs> nigga is cuz he explained himself okay kuna maybe to some extent there are some aspects that the guy is full of himself the si maringo the guy probably <clears throat> feels he's you know too big than what he actually is um it's also a little thing na watu wa ushago thing wase waocha wakiomoka kidogo jondo wana dunning you know they have the world you know in their hands but he explained himself very well and i've also what i realized in that interview is that otile that was like actually scratch everything i've just said the otile brown obina interview was actually the best interview of of, of otile brown i have seen in years the guy um was very very free yes akianza alianza na uto to maringo but he also explained himself he said he's an introvert and he likes to read the room fast uh, he likes to check the energy fast which is some <coughs> weaker female bill bullshit he was talking about star signs who the fuck talks about star signs when you have cojones mtu wangu you don't talk about star signs star signs achia wanawake hizo ni vitu za wanawake bro you know but as long as you have two cojones in between your legs don't ever catch yourself dead talking about star signs okay leave that shit for the women and gay people so honestly it was the best interview of otile brown i have seen in years he was free annually walikuwa na bonga na obina kama my boys and honestly it's very very wholesome to watch such an interview it's very very wholesome you get a lot from the interview otile brown opened up in such a way he's never opened up in an interview and that is you know that's what the fans like to see that's what the fans want to see in an interview tumekuja ni utuambie history yako tumekuja utuambie escapades zako in between unaona the embarrassing some of the embarrassing stuff some of the highlights you know the struggle in the journey it was such 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 a great interview the otile brown one the Otile Brown Ogobina interview. It was a dope, 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 dope ass interview. And uh, you know, Otile, not Otile Brown, Nanin. What's your name? Ogobina. Uh, for me, I give you a thumbs up for that. You really, really nailed that interview. You know, um, I've spoken shit about Moafrika, but me, I always say the truth, you know, and the truth gets into people's feelings. But um tukikuja tuangalie uh these guys who have uh, YouTube channels and uh, at the time nini when it comes to doing interviews uh, so far so far so far hands down I've only seen three people who are really really good at their shit Number one is Anonymous Team. Go check out my interview with Tumbili. I left no stone unturned. And it was very, very random, you know. Tumepata na tuna Tumbili hivi kwa garage. Yo, nimeambia Tumbili. Tumbili ameacha dinga yake. Mi nikuwa tuna toka nimesho ni aje. Sini kupiga lift hivi alafu unichapie, unipatie content hapa. It was like, okay. And it wasn't triast, it wasn't planned. And I got to act to ask the uh, serious and important questions you know i'll be looking for him sometime later on and i've just decided to chill out on the interviews but i'll be looking for him sometime later on so that we can do like a proper 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 structured interview so when it comes to conducting interviews anonymous team is number one followed by number two more africa one thing i like about more africa he doesn't let something slide you know like if he asks you a question if he asks you a question and ato jaribu ku deviate aje ata um, change topic ata um, change subject all through the interview even if it's one hour later more africa will still go back and remember shit this guy didn't answer the question that i asked him like an hour ago so more africa na bad ato kijaribu kujificha more africa will try his level best to get an answer from you unaona so honestly more africa is a dope interview i have to give him that followed closely by nani ogobina so initially when ogobina was starting out 
alikuwa akikuuliza kaswali anafuatilia eh wewe mbona ujajibu hii mbona unaepa hii swali anafuatilia but akiona pia unahepa sana pia like anakupe yako kaliwe you are not just supposed to give a guest uh, the leeway to evade a question without kuchimba chimba ama hata ukihepa fanya kitu mwafrika ufanya guest akihepa kaswali ni sawa deviate kidogo deviate kidogo then rudi pale <laughs> <laughs> Rudi pale hata kama ni three times ama four times if you have to so that at least cause it's for the fans bana it's for the people watching that interview it's, you know when when um when a guest leaves a question unanswered like it lingers the fan is nini anabaki unsatisfied una cheki it's like you're a porn addict and you're masturbating eh and then ile nini ile but your climax ndio hiyo imefika and then there, there you're going right there you're going there you're going there you're going and all of, all of a sudden the pawn ends like what the fuck <laughs> yo masturbation is not good for your health stop that shit so yeah so yeah that's what i'm saying the I saw a difference a big difference between all the other Oga Obina interviews and this one maybe it was good because he was interviewing his friends cuz even the you know if we take out the side shows from from Nini the Timothy that interview it was also good it was also dope but honestly otile brown interview was the best because and so far i think i'll go on record saying that out of all the ogobina interviews that is done the otile brown interview stands out it's best because he got to break down otile brown in a way otile brown has never been broken in an interview otile brown was so free and no no jamal kwa alikuwa na G-Express ni kama venye mnaweza kuwa na mnabonga na boys hadi mjamani kama amesahau kama kuna cameras around the guy was so 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 free which is dope so ogo bina thumbs up yeah thumbs up keep uh, you know uh, thumbs up keep it up but now hopefully uh, the next interviews they are like that but now usiache usiache guest ajaribu kuhepa like uh, i don't know how you did it or what you did with the Brown interview but to make a guest so comfortable ah uh, bro bro it's it's a you know it's a it's a skill that needs to be learned making a guest comfortable you can be a good interview you can be a great interviewer like team anonymous team or more africa but to make a guest comfortable ah ah yeah yeah yeah, yeah. it's like breaking the ice unaona eh yeah, it's like breaking the yani ah it was i really liked it i honestly liked it that interview gets 100% for me